everybody, it's Chucka Conroy, and welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. Last time, we returned peace to the Great Sea that was not actually the Great Sea the entire time. It's complicated, and I'm also trying to be very non-specific because I have prying ears that have not played through the main story of this game. So, um, let's stop all the spoiler talk and introduce our guest that is going to be joining us here today for... Anytime now you want to pop up Battle Mode. Hello. Wow, I can't believe you just spoiled this entire game for me, Emil. Well, I mean, all you know is that it's not the Great Sea, but you don't exactly know how it's not the Great Sea. <laughs> it might be, you know, the Great Sea the entire time might have been a volcano. You don't know. That, that, that doesn't, what? I've swam inside a volcano before. It's plausible. Okay. Stranger things have happened in Hawaii, in your own country. Country? Because we're in the United States. What do you think I meant? I thought you were calling Hawaii another country, and you were pointing at me like, it's in your country. Oh. <laughs> you pointed the stylus at me as you said it, Emil. It's a pretty big stylus. Too. Yes. Any anyway. Uh... Hello, I'm a Sanella. Back for another round of punishment. Oh. <laughs> Whenever we do videos together, it's always like 10 minutes to get to introducing <laughs> the other person because we just argue. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so going over what this is, um, you can play with other game cards, the full multiplayer mode. There's a DS download play mode that is frankly watered down, and, well, there used to be online service for this game, but I take too damn long to get to making these Let's Plays, so hmm. here we are. Uh, there is a private server for DS uh, online play that's actually opened up recently, so if you want to get that going, maybe you can. It doesn't require hacking or modifications or anything, How actually. recently is recently? Uh, less than a year. Oh, wow. Yeah, DS and Wii actually had their stuff restored by, like, fans who brought it back, though. I don't know, like, how reliable it is, though, but I just thought I'd bring it up that it is something you can do. Um, you can change your name independently of your single-player file. Here, I've gone with Chugga, so you know which one is me. Uh, and then, I guess we're just gonna get into it right away. There's Hooray! Ciela being colored blue in a lot of artwork that is not inside of the main game. It's me! I'm here. It's me say. Oh, God. <laughs> Ooh, I get to pick the stage. You, uh, we uh, did this a little bit earlier to kind of get her familiar with the mechanics of the game and just to kind of, uh, frankly, play it for the very first time myself because I've never met anybody who wanted to play this before. <laughs> <laughs> so I played it for the first time earlier today, but we did a few rounds, and I think I understand how it works. I've read up on it, and I think we got it pretty well done. So, um... I talked for too long and it forcibly selected a stage for me, but it- It picked stage one it, anyway! It picked the one I was gonna click on anyway! <laughs> wow, okay, well, um- Cool, I'm I, a video game psychic. I honestly thought that, uh, I honestly thought that it was going to have us vote and it would just do a coin flip or something. Nope, you were the only one who got to pick stages before. I, I honestly did not know that. So, oh! uh- <laughs> That so my first long. round was playing as the Phantom Trio. They are unkillable gray phantoms that you only play as. They follow paths that you draw on the touch screen. Uh, you take turns playing as them. The other one is Link, and you're trying to get the forest gems back to your base to collect points. You have a time limit to do this. Two minutes by default. Hello. And oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> I thought I could roll out of the way. Fast rounds. I feel like their hitboxes are way more unforgiving than the phantoms in the main game because... I, I roll in and out of those guys' armpits like it's nothing in the main Ew. game. Yet, in this one, I I sort of oh, no. oh, have I... a fate about as bad as you would expect from being in guys' armpits, so, you know. That That's gross. I'm just trying to plan ahead here. Hopefully, like, lead my fire, I guess, if you want to call it fire. Uh, I can't see where she is on the map when she's in safe zones, but I can see where she is when she's out of them. It's very much... The uh, quintessential experience of actually being a phantom. Music just got a lot more tense for some reason. Are you camping? No. Why would I camp right now? I just don't know where to go. Well, I got a tip for you. You're uh, dropping and running. That is actually faster than just carrying the item outright. So you got an item. Oh, one hit immunity. <laughs> so you're just going to powerhouse on through, I take it. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to do something. I'm going to try my best. Really? Yes. I mean, it's all you can do. 
I mean, I could also try not very hard and cross my fingers. Somehow, I'm not sure if I'm doing this. <laughs> I guess you're just getting yourself in good positions for later in case I mess up or something. Or Okay, there's not one hit. And, uh, oh, there was almost two hits. Thank goodness for the I, invincibility time. I honestly forgot. <laughs> you're down to only 20 seconds to make a move, by the way. Yes, I know. Leave me alone. Don't pressure me. Ha! Here comes the pressure. There it is! <sighs> you got a lot of them on your side of the field, so you might be able to score some easy points at the beginning of next round when I'm on the opposite goal. I'm speaking like it's sports. I mean, technically, it's, it's Zelda sports, right? This could definitely be a sport of its own inside of the world of the Ocean King. Uh, <laughs> I don't like how I can't see you on the map like I can in single player. I keep expecting to go like, oh, the phantoms aren't here yet because I don't see them on the map. Uh, this is bad. I'm gonna. I'm already calling a loss right here because you've got these easy points to start off because you set up and I can't get over there fast enough. Heck yeah. Oh no! Hi. Well, I got one okay, easy point. Okay, five to zero. I'll, I'll take it. I this mean, goes I, for three rounds. I have to. I have to say that I wasn't really expecting my first time to play Phantom Hourglass would be this. This mode is not what I expected, honestly. I thought they were gonna give us swords and boomerang, stick us in a field, and let us hit each other. That's kind of what I, I thought. I it was, was going expecting to be. that when you told me about it. When you were like, "Hey, do you want to do some Phantom Hour?" Some Phantom Hourglass multiplayer, I was like, yeah, sure. Why the heck not? Well, oh, I desperately need the points because you have five, I got nothing. So let's get some easy points there. You can steal from the other person's goal, but it's a much greater distance to move across. Of course, you don't want to do that. Here, I'm picking up an item that gives me 30 more seconds on my turn. It's honestly very awkward to to draw these lines because it these... looks like I'm wearing a police hat on the top screen. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of does. Yeah, you can get stuck on walls and stuff. It's not always great, unfortunately. Uh, the touchscreen controls in this game are usually pretty good, though, but they do mess up from time to time. Yeah, the, this map is not easy. Just a lot of corners and stuff. I do, I do think that we're getting the hang of it a little bit better than we did earlier. I guess. I can see that. Just trying to focus and not die. <laughs> It'd be so much easier to play if we didn't do all this pesky talking! Ha-ha! <laughs> My style has hit the lip of the screen. <laughs> oh, oh, no! Oh, well, I'm down. That is the last <laughs> round that I get. So, at this point, that's game. You you were you were coming back from it though. Oh, I thought I won. No, those those were worth one point each. I thought they were each worth five. No, I, <laughs> I got thought a medium I had ten crystal. And you, had five. you got two smalls, I got one medium. I thought the smalls were five. No! I thought they were like five, ten, and then fifteen. No! <laughs> so I thought I was winning. <laughs> uh. It's okay. Okay, well... You did well! Complete big place to add to your battle points. Uh, all right. So, I'm gonna exit out, if I may. Uh, no, I, you may not. I Play actually, games with me now! Actually, I can't. Uh... Oh, sorry. Uh... Oh, I apologize. Well, I was, I was going to explain more stuff, though, but, uh, let's go into this stage, because it looks absolutely nuts. I, I was being sarcastic. Back to backstage! Your cat is bothering me. Yeah. Oh, we start with points in our goals in this one. And our goals are near each uh, other, too. Oh, 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 oh. This, this is interesting. Also, this remix of the of the Hyrule Field theme from Ocarina of Time is really solid, and it's, like, better than most of the music in the main game, but nobody ever heard this, like, clearly. That is absolutely, like... Sad? Not, no, no. Well, yes, it is sad, but that is also not the song that I am hearing. Yeah, you hear different music when you're the Phantoms, but... I get absolutely sad. Yes, but... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I should also mention that screen wrapping is a thing. Like well, so. it's more like warping in this one. 
Well, you go to the opposite side regardless, so there we go. That's a shield. I have no idea where the clue you are. Where the clue you are. This is so hard to move around as Isn't a phantom. It? <laughs> Isn't it? Isn't it just? It's pretty awkward. What? No. Oh, God. That was my... Okay, I had an extra hit. <laughs> uh, that was like that one time when I just like stood still and took it. Okay, well, I'm setting up here. Give me those Pegasus <laughs> boots. They are only in multiplayer. One of these stupid... Phantoms. Ha-ha! <laughs> I feel good. I took away your item, I guess. And one of I'll these, take away this one, too! One of these dumb phantoms will just only go in a circle. I think he's just stuck. Oh, no, there he goes. Man, I don't imagine dead people have a whole lot of brain. I'd like to imagine that he could move, though! Three, two, one... Throw it! Change sides. Made it through the entire round. Wow. The, the this is a nightmare to get around. As, as <sighs> well, I guess now it's my turn. Uh, you can't go through the gusts of wind in the middle, but you can throw items over them, as I learned. And the phantoms can traverse them, I guess. Alright, this, this, this is a little bit rude. This is this is slightly rude. Go on. Come on! Seriously? Like Okay, I saw you go somewhere else. Man, this, th nope, I'm gonna lose. <laughs> I'm gonna freaking lose. I'm not gonna lie, this map is pretty nasty. <laughs> I don't. It's nasty on both ends, honestly. It really is. Like I don't, I wouldn't say I enjoyed playing either position. It was really death-defying being Link, and then being the Phantoms was also kind of, kind of crummy. But luckily, you're all the way over there, which means there we go, easy points. that. What? Well, I guess now I'll never know. <laughs> I got an item and I don't know what it did. It, it looked like some kind of like urn with a creepy face on it. Oh, that, mm, that sounds pleasant. It's Tet Urn. I've noticed it's a common trend in my life, thinking that I won when in reality I was miscounting the points entirely. Yeah, that does seem to happen a bit. Okay, she says. Once in a while. This map is really awkward. Isn't it though? Moving around in it as the phantoms is so bad. I wish I had an Excel screen, but I don't. Uh... I guess I have a, a bit of an advantage. Oh, you have the Pegasus way. boots. I'm screwed. What? I no. am so screwed. I don't have the Pegasus boots. Yes, you do. You're like zipping all over the place. No. Oh, wait. Do I actually? Yes. Oh. I'm pretty sure you, you picked up some item and then you started zipping around like you. Oh, I, I guess I didn't Twizzler notice. Or something. Ate a Twizzler? I don't know. I was trying to think of some sugary food, and that was what came to mind. <laughs> you know, the old saying. The old saying of eat a Twizzler and move fast. Man, for someone who said they're screwed, you're actually in the lead right now. I was screwed, and then I became not screwed. 
by sheer force of will. Nope. Ah, bye. I don't like these controls. <laughs> this is what it took to finally break me and say that there's controls in this game. Well, I, I kind of always maintained that, so I won't say that this really broke me, but... You have a clone. But I got Wait. the real one! Yo, what, what, how does the clone work? Uh, the one that's not you is a decoy that the, fa that the other player might attack. Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought it was essentially an extra hit again. No, it, the, the shield's the extra hit. The music is so beautiful. <laughs> it's funny on my end because I just hear the super, the super serious, like, dun dun, dun dun dun. And you're like, this music is beautiful. So they actually stay your color as long as they don't reach my goal is what I'm noticing. Yes. That's kind of cool. So I have to get them there. It's not just enough for me to remove them from your goal. Yeah, it makes it a little bit Whoa. more fair. Uh, go, 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 go. No, no, no. You really have to like kind of be careful and watch where you're going, I notice. Ba -da -da! You also gotta not get stuck on corners! Ain't that the truth? I, I feel like corners are the biggest enemy greater than like anything else's. Um, items are also really good. That was not a shield. <laughs> that would have been really lucky if it were a shield. Yeah, I just kind of rushed it and oh well. At least I have the lead right now. I just have to put up with this for another round. <laughs> this is the last round, thankfully, so... Hopefully it gets decided. We agreed best two of three, so if I manage to win this, I get to give us the gift of not having to put up with this anymore. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> what a You really didn't game. want to play this, did you? <laughs> oh, screw this game. I'm done playing. Oh, wow. I automatically win because I had more points going into my turn. Okay, well. We played two rounds. Yes. You said best two out of three. Yes. I won one and you won one. Oh shoot, that's right. I was thinking of the practice <laughs> round where I won. You have to play one more whether you like it or not. <laughs> Imagine if I didn't say anything and you're just like, oh, it's best two out of three, I win. I'd have to call you back here to do more recording because I would never be able to live that down publicly. <laughs> I swear I wasn't trying to, okay, maybe I was trying to get out of having to play more of this, but <laughs> like, Really, like they made it a real-time strategy game for one person and then kind of like a, I guess like a, maybe like a dungeon crawler for the other one? I don't know, but you get to pick the stage. Uh, don't kill us. Hmm. Oh, that looks miserable. Like can you see it? That's Yeah, I can see it. It's like okay. a Pac-Man maze. Oh, it does look like Pac-Man. Oh, you're oh, no. random. You took too long. You <laughs> ruined everything! <laughs> Oh, it's like a Pac-Man maze. Oh, is it? It actually, you hit, it did random because you took too long and then it, uh. Oh my God, okay. Okay, well, we're doing it, we're doing it. Oh my God, why? Sound like strong bird. No. It's all right. It's okay, don't whine. We're, we're doing this for the good of your audience. I got really confused for half a second because I thought it was blue again. Yeah. That is a little weird that the colors aren't locked ah! in, even though we're not changing positions. Yeah, that is a little bit strange. So it's like a big treasure trove up there in the middle, and you have to get all the way up there and get out, and it's very maze-like. That's interesting. I have to say, we do a lot of multiplayer bonus video type things at the end of a lot of series because a lot of games have multiplayer modes, even though they're, you know, ostensibly single-player games. But... This one might be my least favorite in a while. It, this one is not great, I have to say. It's an interesting idea. I just think the controls do kind of hold it back. The fact that one person is just kind of moving with the touchscreen and the other has to draw lines. and Like, I guess it would be a little too easy if you could move with the Phantom, though. But, uh, spoiler alert, the sequel to this game made moving as a Phantom a lot more intuitive and did it very well. Wow, I, mean, I can't believe you're spoiling multiple games for me today. Uh, that's... Granted, that one I have actually played. Yeah, I knew that you played that one, but... At least the 
music's nice. Every time you say that, <laughs> you're hearing the crappy song. I'm here. I'm hearing the bad music, but it's just like great. Why do I sound like an angry woman every time? Is is that what I sound like when I'm angry? I mean, my mother, yes, but not you. <laughs> Whenever I did like that like <laughs> birdie voice, like everyone's always like your mother. <laughs> oh my god. That voice was just always my mom whenever she was angry about anything. Okay, strength up and speed up. I'm gonna run right into a phantom, I can tell. Whoa! Yeah, that's the one thing about like <laughs> Iron Man in it. There we go. That's the one thing about, uh... Woohoo! Oh, I look like I'm doing a constipation on that, About the Pegasus boots in this is that I always have that feeling that I'm just gonna run into someone anyway. Yeah, I kind of feel it too. I don't like it. Ah, there we go. Change sides. I did quite a bit of damage on that one. I think I got seven points. No, 11. I stole your points. Yep. There. You're going over here. Uh, okay, so... I didn't even get to explain it. I was listening out for the music this time instead of just kind of having it autopilot. This music is from the single player. The soundtrack that I told you is bad. Oh. So the good song is the multiplayer exclusive one and the bad one is in the single player normally. Well. So that's pretty self-fulfilling. Did I can turn off the blower and stuff a much easier time though, but I have to find an item for that, I guess. Gosh, thank goodness these gray phantoms aren't the standard. Also, if I may just say that drawing really long lines and just having these phantoms go on autopilot is also not the greatest. It's like, I feel like no matter what I do here, I, it's just not intuitive. I'm sure someone out there likes it and got used to it. For that, I salute you. Hey, I salute you. You got used to it right there. <laughs> you were better than me. Yeah. Okay. One more round. How bad could it be? I'm You're sorry. winning. I'm sorry. I, I, know, I know I'm winning, and I'm sure there's, you know... <laughs> it's a good idea. It is. It's like those times where you just like try to find something nice to say. But it's hard. Hi! <laughs> Not quite! No, wait, what? Did you have an item? No. I thought I really had you. No, I just dodged. 30 more seconds. Flush her out! Really? Wait! I had like one toe out of that freaking barrier! Just a toe! I basically, like, peeked around the corner and got a face full of sword. I did not like that stage. Uh, it was a thing. So I'd like to point out that you rank up from winning matches. There is actually, like, a ranked system in this. I've won four matches tonight. I have 241 points, whatever that means, and I'm still rank H. <laughs> I have not ranked up one time. I'm still... The fact that it starts all the way down at H, and apparently four wins is not enough to rank it up, I have to wonder how much work it actually That's takes to get up. pretty sad. So I'm going to quit also, out of this. Also, yeah. it, it just gave me, like, a tip on this screen that specifically tells you to throw the gems. Oh. It's like, don't carry big gems around. It's faster to throw them as you go. And it's true. It's a good tip. Yeah, I just wasn't expecting them to admit that the walking speed is garbage <laughs> 
I mean, it's pretty obvious, but uh, it is. The, the big gem walking speed is worse than it is in the single player. It, it's like, probably a tip saying like, "Hey, do you want to know why you suck at this? This is why." Uh, well, that was certainly unexpected to have it be a real-time strategy game. Not what I saw coming. It, it it was interesting. Yes. It's a it's an idea. Well, what it was saying was to up your rank and earn more points, you want to do the big plays. What are big plays? Well, I'm going to open this up right now. Uh, they are a list of achievements. I've earned a few of them already. Uh, looks like five. Uh, so the big plays, I've not earned all of them because you have to do a lot of crazy stuff to get them. They are as follows. No items. Win without taking a single item. This one is no dribble, which is win but don't drop force gems outside bases or safe zones. So you have to commit every time you pick one up. Wow. Limit. Win a match felling Link in the last 20 seconds of two of the turns. Solo. Defeat Link in any in uh, any one turn using only one phantom, which I actually did do. Uh, break. Break 10 or more of your opponent's helpful items. Yikes. Uh, that seems really hard. Uh, this one is take. Pick up 10 or more of your own items. Now we have perfect master. Complete a perfect and limit at the same time, which we have not seen what a perfect is, which begs the question why it's this early in the list. Uh, this next one is called quick. Win a match felling link in the first 20 seconds of two of the turns. I feel like you would have to just grind these out with a friend. So I, I was just about to run say into that. My phantom, please. I was just about to say that that most of these just sound like hello. Please help me complete this list. Which, hmm. I have miracle, which is win one and zero. Uh, this next one is called get everything. Win turning all the force gems your color. Guardian. Win without letting your opponent score any points. Perfect. Complete both get everything and guardian to get so there's that one that's clear with getting perfect and something else and Perfect is do this and also that so it's like a tree of things you have to accomplish at the same time Yikes. Uh, We already saw get everything that's getting all the items and guardian was uh, Win without letting your opponent score any points that means to get that really hard one the perfect master you have to not not let your opponent score a single point all game you have to Turn all the force gems your color, so you have to get all the points as well. And then you also have to beat Link within 20 seconds twice. Wow. For one achievement. This sounds like a mode. <laughs> uh, <laughs> aptly put. You're an expert on this topic, which is why I brought you in. Great. <laughs> uh, this one is no miss when without letting uh, when without being taken down as taken down once as Link. Uh, Guard King, take Link down three times as the Phantoms. Okay, that's fair enough. Don't let time expire, basically. Uh, Master, complete a no miss and a Guardian at the same time, which win without letting your opponent score points and win without being taken down once as Link. And then Battle Master, which I am scared what this is, complete a limit and Master at the same time, which in total that means beat Link in 20 seconds twice, do not be taken down once, and don't let your opponent score one point in one game. Ooh. That's dreadful. <laughs> so. Yes. You ready to start? Start what? Start getting all these achievements. I'm not. <laughs> Are you sure? I was about Are to. Are you ready? I was about to explain. Let's go. Let's go. Let's I was about it. to explain the real diarrhea doo-doo about oh, this. Oh, no. So, the purpose of these big plays... I may cut away to what I've done. I've earned five of these things. Every fourth one you earn, you are guaranteed a golden ship part, but you get a random one. <laughs> Meaning you can get a duplicate. Thankfully, you can save and reload before opening the chest, but I wouldn't expect a first timer to really know that. So it's possible that somebody did all this Played this for like hundreds of hours because you could play this online back in the day to find opponents, and just got the same part four times and had to do the item trading to get do item trading with other players to get the others. Man. Yeah. So that's a thing. That is how you get everything in battle mode. So when are you doing it? 
I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I just loved the look I, of just complete and utter dread on your face when I said <laughs> it. Just like the color legitimately just drained from your face. And I was like, so when? So that's pre- that's totally revenge for saying, are you going to have me on for next Captain Toad? Oh, heck yeah. Yes. <laughs> so thank you for joining us. That is everything you have to do to 100% this mode. I'm not interested in doing it, but I told you everything that you need to know to do it and gave you all the hot tips of summer fashion, so you may try. I, I will treasure this first experience that I had with Phantom Hourglass. I swear it's not that indicative of the rest of the game. <laughs> I, okay. Thank you so much for coming. This was a strangely fun time. It, it was fun. It's always fun playing games with you. Aww. So thank you for having me on. Thank you. I hope that those of you who like this mode don't hate me too much. I'm sure they don't mind. It'll be fine. <laughs>